Topping our news, it is the last weekend before Manatee County students will be heading back to school. And in Sarasota County, there's still a few days to get those last minute supplies. One local mother, however, is helping those less fortunate cross off the final items on their school supply list. ABC 7's Erica Jackson joins us live in Sarasota for a closer look at those efforts. Erica. Good evening, Adam. You can find a notebook like this for about 25 or 50 cents, but students also need calculators and folders and pens and pencils, and the cost of those items can add up quickly. So that's why the Sarasota Police Department and other community members are giving parents one less reason to stress. You got to get clothes, shoes, and some stuff I can't get. It's a year of first for Destiny Dexter. She recently got her four kids back from the Department of Children and Families. Now her one year old is getting ready to start daycare for the first time as her daughter prepares for first grade. She grew out of her shoes, so she has to buy more shoes, got to buy more clothes, so she's growing up. Also growing the cost of clothing and school supplies for her kids. A survey by the National Retail Federation finds families will spend nearly $700 this year on supplies. But Dexter thinks she's spending more with four kids heading to school. With the daycare, I have to buy pull ups. They bring blankets, mats, and all that stuff. Even if they have a job, it's still hard because you have bills. Newtown mom and local comedian Latrice Allen sees family struggle this time of year, which is why she asked her fans around the country for help. We basically raised our money, like $1,500. And then I had some sending in packages and sending and still sending in money to help me out with this. Now dozens of kids will be ready for the first day of school with brand new backpacks filled with supplies. Allen says Sunday's school supply drive did not discriminate based on a family's income, but she made sure the only kids taking home backpacks did not already have one for this year. Even if you work, you still deserve, you know, to have some time, you know, some money to yourself. Most people are like, oh, no, that's embarrassing, but it's really not. It's, it's helpful. You know, the kids happy. At least they got something to go to school with. And you still have time to donate. The Sarasota Police Department is collecting supplies for kids in need through Wednesday. And the Sarasota County School District is collecting supplies at the Culver's on University Parkway through August 18th. Reporting live in Sarasota, Erica Jackson, ABC 7, your Suncoast News.